Hello, sports fans. Welcome to the program. We start today with association football, as per usual. The semifinal matches were played on Saturday, the 24th of March, 1928. The Black Rovers defeated Arsenal 1-0, with Huddersfield Town came to a 2-2 draw against Sheffield United. In the replay, both teams scored 0. In the second replay, Huddersfield Town defeated Sheffield United 1-0. In the 1928 FA Cup Final, Blackburn Rovers won 3-1 over Huddersfield Town, making this the first final in 18 years where both teams scored. In the Scottish Cup semi-finals, Celtic defeated Queen's Park 2-1, with the Rangers defeated Hibernian 3-0. At the final, the Rangers defeated Celtic 4-0. In baseball, in the American League, Babe Ruth of the New York Yankees hit 54 home runs, with Lou Gehrig and Babe Ruth, both of the New York Yankees, scoring 142 RBIs. Lefty Groove of the Philadelphia Athletics threw 183 strikeouts, and Buddy Myers of the Boston Red Sox stole 30 bases. The top five teams at the season's ending were the Chicago White Sox in fifth, the Washington Senators in fourth, St. Louis Browns in third, the Philadelphia Athletics in second. With the New York Yankees in first, they are the American League pennant holders. In the National League, Jim Bottomley of the St. Louis Cardinals and Hack Wilson of the Chicago Cubs each hit 31 home runs. Jim Bottomley also scored 136 RBIs. Dazzy Vance of the Brooklyn Robins threw 200 strikeouts and Kiki Coiler of the Chicago Cubs stole 37 bases. The five top teams at the end of the season are the Cincinnati Reds in fifth, the Pittsburgh Pirates in fourth, the Chicago Cubs in third, the New York Giants in second, and with the St. Louis Cardinals in first, they are the National League pennant holders. In the Negro National League, the season's final standings have the Detroit Stars in third, the Kansas City Monarchs in second, and the St. Louis Stars in first. At the Baseball World Series, the 1928 World Series was the 25th edition of the World Series. It matched the American League champions, the New York Yankees, against the National League champions, the St. Louis Cardinals. The Yankees beat the Cardinals in four games to win their third championship and the first team to do a back-to-back -back sweep. In the NFL, the Detroit Wolverines and New York Yankees left the league after this season, dropping the league to 10 teams. The seven top teams at the end of the season are the New York Yankees in 7th, the New York Giants in 6th, the Chicago Bears in 5th, the Green Bay Packers in 4th, the Detroit Wolverines in 3rd, the Frankfurt Yellow Jackets in 2nd, and the Providence Steamrollers in 1st as the NFL champions. In the NHL, in the Canadian division, the New York Yankees were in fifth, the Toronto Maple Leafs were in fourth, the Ottawa Senators were in third, the Montreal Maroons were in second, and the Montreal Canadiens landed in first place. In the American division, the Chicago Blackhawks were in fifth, the Detroit Cougars were in fourth, the Pittsburgh Pirates were in third, the New York Rangers were in second, and the Boston Bruins landed in first. At the NHL Stanley Cup Finals, the New York Rangers defeated the Montreal Maroons three games to two to win the Stanley Cup. This was the first appearance by the Rangers in the finals in only their second season. At the Indianapolis 500, George Soldiers arrived in third driving a Miller, with Lou Moore landing in second driving a Miller, and Lewis Meyer landed in first place, also driving a Miller. At the 24 Hours of Le Mans, France's Grand Garage Saint Diddler Paris arrived in third with a Chrysler 6 Series 72. In second place was Society Societe de Carrosserie Vedman driving a Stutz model BB Blackhawk. And in first place was Bentley Motors Limited of the United Kingdom driving a Reuben Bentley 4.5 liter. In Home Nations Rugby, Team England swept the league by winning the Grand Slam, the Triple Crown, the Calcutta Cut, and the Six Nations Championship. The Wooden Spoon was not awarded this year. 
This completes the program. Please subscribe and comment if you'd like. Until next time, thank you for watching and goodbye.